This particular shot, a lot of people make a mistake and they get afraid of trying to shoot it the correct way. And the correct way is going around the table to play shape for this ball that's down the other end of the table. So they have some kind of a fear or whatever happens in their minds, but they always try to go backwards this way and they wind up scratching and blaming everybody but themselves. So the correct way to go is forward three rails going this way in this direction, coming here, down this way. And also, a lot of people make a mistake or they think that they have to hit the rail first uh, to make the ball, uh, which is not true. You hit the ball first to go around the table. If you hit the rail first, then your cue ball is going to take this type of direction. We more than likely you're going to scratch or it's going to be over here somewhere and you won't get close to playing shape for this ball down the other end of the table. So we want to play this shot with top left and try to hit the ball first. Uh, all right, I'll try to demonstrate that first and then I'll show you it, what happens when you hit the uh, rail first. Here we go. Now remember, you have to add for your deflection, because this is inside English, and you cannot aim at the same place that you would aim with no English. When you use the left-hand English, you have to aim at a fuller ball as if you were trying to shoot it into the rail over here. And the deflection when you hit the cue ball will take its place and you'll hit the correct spot on the one ball, which is approximately right there. Okay, let's try it. That's the way that shot should go. Now I'll demonstrate what happens if you hit the rail first. And remember, always to mark your shot so you have the same one all the time. Here we go again. There you go. That's the direction of the cue ball if you hit the rail first. You make the ball both ways, but one way you get shaped to where you want to go. The other way you're going to have a real tough shot trying to get out. <laughs> 